guys today I want to show you how my bases look like I'm playing solo on a I think it's a five times harvesting server so not that slowly first I'm gonna show you my boat it's a really nice boat I crafted it after a bit of time in metal which is really safe it looks like this see I got a turret here I watched YouTube video as well how to do it and uh, yeah I will link that uh, so you can build it as well if you want to yeah here I can drive pretty close to to those uh, iron areas where I can uh, get the iron and I'm in the, th in the south, so there are not very many uh, iron areas, metal areas, but that's alright. I hope you can see now where I am. I'm down in the southwest, and over there there's a, a mountain where you can get a bit of iron. This is my my boat I can I can go wherever I want and I have everything with m with me and I can craft everything which is really nice I really like building small houses I don't really like those things other players do you see this base here this doesn't look beautiful at all they got much stuff pretty secure defenses and everything but it doesn't look beautiful and if you look at this here try to build some little castle I would say this is what it looks like three defense plans but uh, it's pretty friendly server so I don't get uh, attacked very often sometimes people want to destroy this this pipe which powers the plants uh, that's why I build it in metal so no one can like just destroy it with a dino they need to put a lot of resources in if you do it with C4 or something yeah this is the pet the pet area here I got three pteranodons and one RG with the RG I tamed a saber tooth which is pretty nice for getting shit in just go in one of the in the central cave I go there you can get lots of shit in with metal and shit in you're pretty much safe because you can build almost everything this is my spaceship one I can fly with not very high level but it's alright I try to level on the weight a little stamina because if you don't know this roll you can do with a C makes such a good attack and it's it's really really nice you can kill almost everything with it so it depends on the stamina if you got lots of stamina then you can deal with it here that's the entrance you see I got a balcony and a, a, a high above balcony but people think oh well if I want to break in there I just destroy with a big ass dino this upper area the wooden area which is really uh, easy to break through instead of this metal area but if you go in there so if you go in there you will see there's like metal all the way this is not... I neglected it a, a little bit. I want to build their stuff soon so that it looks better and more advanced. If you go up there then you see I put a, a water tank there because sometimes people destroy your pipes. They just want to like uh, get rid of your plants that way. Yeah. I built this, this tank so I know this and yeah can go up there show you my my view around this is one of the first bases first uh, bigger bases I 
as I said, I don't really like those really bulky uh, square bases. That's why I try to build something like this. I would love to build one over there a little bit bigger than the one I, I built now. But also a bit more crafty, a bit more stylish. That's the goal. And I'll see if this works. But always you have to keep in mind that always people try to raid you and that's why it's better to be safe and always build the bottom part with metal. It takes a while but it's pretty pretty easy and safe. Like this I can go there, sleep. This plant is actually pretty out of out of use. I want to build some up on the ceiling, so if people break through, they are attacked by the plants immediately. I will, I will see. Maybe I'll. Uh, I'm looking forward to 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 building a new one. Just build all the metal walls and then, like, get the whole structure going with thatch walls and everything, and then just immediately replace it with metal so that it looks better. Yeah, that's my base. And uh, if you have any suggestions what could be better, could be worse or something you've learned or any questions you have, you can ask them right away. I don't have that many dinos. I don't... Uh, I, I look like a low priority target for other players if I'm that small, just with a, with a few little dinos. But with those dinos you have everything you need to, to build up a a really big uh, really big base and uh, you have everything you need yeah maybe you need an ankylosaurus to uh, to harvest uh, the stones and the metal more efficiently but that's that's all I've got right now and for the ankylosaurus you need a quetzal and this is pretty difficult to tame if you're playing solo as I'm doing and yeah, the saber tooth I tamed in this little den here. I grabbed it by the really big mountain. I grabbed it with the Argentavis. I flew it over there, dropped it in there, and then immediately torpored it and tamed it with prime meat. I gathered with those birds because this attack is just insane. You can drop all those boas, all those snakes and everything in the swamp so that's why you can tame them pretty easily I mean this server has accelerated rates but not that many I would suggest to fi you to find a server 3 to 5 raid 3 to 5 on everything then it's pretty good you're leveling up pretty fast and you don't need to spend hours and hours to gather resources. Yeah, that's it. Those ovens, they, they are working Yeah, pretty much all the time. I got some metal ingots. Not that much, not that much cementing paste, but yeah. Latest invention here, the air conditioner. Maybe when I go into the cold areas, then it's pretty good to have those. Yeah, but that's my base, and I can go everywhere with this little base here, and I'll show you a trick, if you go out on the sea, like far away from the coast, close to the boundaries of the map, no one really finds you, no one really finds you, that's why I have all my good stuff in there, all the metal ingots, all the cementry paste, the bird just sits on top, it bothers no one, it never got killed or anything. People don't raid this thing here. I think it takes way too many resources and it looks so small, so people expect that there's close to nothing in there. Yeah, that's how it is. I'll link you the video where the guy just showed how to build a boat like this and yeah. I will make some more videos in the future, I'll see.
I'm get re I'm really excited what they will release next, and I'll see what's coming up next. Just leave a comment, and if you like it, just keep watching. Bye bye.